In today's Madden 21 breakdown, I'm going to be showing you a little route combination that you can use to absolutely destroy the cover two zone in Madden NFL 21. What's up guys, my name is Cody and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch today's video. Now, if you've never been to my channel before, my channel focuses in on Madden 21 tips and tricks uh, that basically are designed to help you get better at this game. So. Uh, if you're interested in getting those tips every single day, like I said, we post four times a day. I would encourage you to go ahead and click the subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. All right, guys. So uh, I wanted to give you a play breakdown. This comes to us from the gun bunch formation in the New England Patriots playbook. This is one of my favorite plays in the Patriots playbook. And um, it's going to come to us out of the, the uh, gun bunch formation. Now we're going to talk specifically about coverage press. The first thing I want to show you is I'm going to shade my curl flats to 30 yards. And the reason I'm going to shade them to 30 yards, normally they're not going to be at that. Normally they're probably going to be at 20 to 25, depending on your opponent. But the reason I'm going to do that is I want to show you the specific route that comes to us out of the gun bunch. Now this play was a popular play a few years ago. And I actually think this play can be really effective this year. It's called Pat's Curl Flat. Um, we're just going to pick it right here. And all we're going to do with this play is we're going to take our right of screen uh, slot receiver and put him on a streak. We're going to put our left of screen outside receiver on an in route, and I like to smart route the in route. And this is basically the route combination. It might look familiar. This is a simple flood concept. Now, uh, I'm running cover two, and I'm just going to leave this slot receiver in the, in the compression of the bunch here, and I just want you to watch the play and watch it play out. What you'll see is this little deep corner route is going to get wide open against that cover two zone. And that's cloud flats. That's cloud flat coverage. So we're literally uh, cover two. And let me just show you the play so you can see these outside corners are in cloud flats. So what you'll see here, again, just leave that compressed bunch at the snap of the ball. What you're going to see is this R1. It's the deepest corner route from the bunch. And as you can see, it just absolutely torches the coverage to the outside. Now, what I want to show you is what if we ran um, what if we ran cover to Mabel? So what they might do is they might take this guy right here and they might drop him into a purple zone. So I just want to show you kind of how this plays uh, with this right here. So this is a 30-yard purple, and what you'll see is he could pass lead that up, and he's going to get over that purple zone. So this gets over every underneath zone in Madden NFL 21, and what it's going to force your opponent to do is it's going to force them to get out of the cover two so what they might do their next step might be to go to cover three and basically and basically run a mabel coverage on the right side of the field and typically out of cover three people like to deep half their outside guys so which will show show you right here again he's going to get out there pass lead that up and as you see right in that little window you're going to get that possession catch all day long and this is 30 yard purple zones i do want to remind you most of the time are not going to be at 30 yards but once you start establishing this they will be at 30 yards and then the next thing I want to show you is cover three. Um, and this is cover three. And let's just say that they leave the outside third because they think the outside third is going to play that outside corner route, which indeed it will. As you can see here, if I try to throw the corner route, the outside third is going to play it. This is where this play really, really um, becomes really, really effective in my opinion. So what you'll see from this is this is just a simple cover three. And uh, I'm going to put that hard flat on the left side. Now, if the safety is coming from left to right, meaning the safety is at the 40-yard line, um, and he's coming from the left side of the screen, what that means is when you throw this ball, um, you'll see that that corner is going to come off, and you can pass lead that to the right for a one-play touchdown against cover three uh, if they were to run something like that. So what the defense is going to have to do, and this is where the defense is really going to be put into a bind, they're going to have to run some kind of cover four because the only zones in the game that are going to be able to hang with the streak and the corner combination are going to be that quarter uh, uh, deep zone. But as you can see here, I can pass lead that down and away against that outside quarter very, very easily. So this really starts to become one of the better route combinations that you can put together on the field. The other nice thing about this, um, and let me just show you cover four again, the other nice thing about this is this has nothing to do with any of the check down reads that we can put on the field. You'll see this tight end out or this tight end flat route this year, if they're not playing hard flats, this is an automatic like 20 yards that you can hit. So this play really starts to put a lot of strain, in my opinion, on the defense, especially on that right side of the field because of the fact that that zone um, on that 
on the purple zones, they not gonna they're not gonna hang even if they're shaded at twenty or I'm sorry, uh, even if they're shaded back or dropped back at thirty yards, they're not gonna be able to hang with this corner route. As you can see right here, if they deep half, he gets over the top of it and it's a laser. It's probably fifteen six or fifty to sixty yard bomb um, right there. So, you know, this is really, really going to help your offense. It's going to beat cover two. It's going to be, you know, what they're basically going to be looking at is they're going to have to run cover three, but they're going to have to flip it, and they're going to have to have it on this hash mark right here. This is the only defense that I know of, and if they run, uh, and they're going to have to run these hard flats. The only problem with that is what that's going to leave vulnerable on the left side is you're going to be able to work this little in route um, on this side right here. So what you'll see here. Um, that outside third will take the corner, he'll match him, and then the um, inside third will take the other uh, player on that play right there. However, what that's going to leave them vulnerable to is a quick hike of the pass verticals play. Literally, all you're going to do is you're going to put your left side guy on a out route, and if they run, um, if they run cover three, and let me just show you that same exact setup. So they run something like that. Then what you're going to see is this R1 route should just torch cover three as you can see right here right up the seam and it's going to be very very effective um that that is kind of this little mini um chess bunch that you're going to play with the patriots gun bunch in my opinion uh the patriots have a very uh respectable bunch in my opinion a lot of people don't really think the patriots bunch is that great um but i actually really really think it's very fairly uh, effective and this is one of the plays that we break down in our latest New England Patriots guide. Um, if you're interested in getting that guide when it drops, again, that guide is still a couple of days away. Um, but what you'll see here, once he gets to the sideline, and that's because of the 30-yard purple zones on the left, but once he gets to the sideline there, so let me show you uh, another example. And like I said, more than likely, if they you know, if they were to do that, something like this, they're going to have to hard flat, guarantee it, because if they don't hard flat, then we're going to hit them in the flats all day long. We're going to hit the running back, we're going to hit the tight end. So in this situation right here, we may go into this verticals play right here, and what you'll see is this left side corner is going to go down, and you're going to be able to basically just lob this ball up once he gets that left hash uh, as a laser against that cover three coverage on the left side. So this really starts to put a lot of stress on the opponent um, with this two-play scheme here uh, from the gun bunch. But if you want to get access to that Patriots guide when it drops, um, just let me know that you'd like to be notified whenever we drop that guide. All you got to do is shoot me a text message. Uh, we'll also be throwing uh, some tips and tricks for this guide as well um, in our text message membership. So if you're not a part of that, make sure you join that um, in the description below. I'll literally, all you got to do is pull out your cell phone, text me. My number is 812-216-3644. Um, and it's also in the top left-hand corner of your screen. But as you can see, this play just completely obliterates cover two. They're not going to be able to run cover two. They're not going to be able to run cover three. Um, they're not going to be able to run cover four. What I think is so really, like, so powerful about this play is the fact that the cover four, um, the cover four defense, which is what something, like, to me, if there was one defense that should hang with this better than most, it would be the cover four. But because of how powerful the streak uh, route is from Gun Bunch, it's going to actually draw um, two defenders with him, and you'll see that on this play right here. Let me just show you uh, and make sure I'm in cover four. And what you'll see, you got that route combination on the right. Watch the outside quarter. The outside quarter is going to flow to the middle of the field. You can pass that down and away. As you can see right there, very easy. Now, obviously, like I said, if they're not coming down on the hard flat, then this is an easy read. I mean, this is literally just a one, you know, one – um, one cut route. Now, I do recommend having Slotomatic on your player because if they're in man to man coverage, let's say they're in man to man coverage here, and we'll show you that. This would be a basic man to man um, coverage, a little cover two man here. Actually, I think I'm in cover two. But if they're in man coverage, basically what's going to happen is Chris Godwin is going to light up and he's going to beat the man to man coverage to the outside. So, man coverage and purples. They're not going to be able to stop it. I'll show you what I'm talking about. So we're going to go to cover three sky here. And we're just going to man up this side of the field like this. And then we'll, we have a purple zone going to that side. Um, and now what you'll see, he's going to get off the jam, come up field, and you can pass lead that basically open. You can either get him away from the corner route or away from the purple zone, or you can get him... Um, right on him and we'll show you this right here 
And if they if they blow the coverage of man, like if they if you get a beat press animation or something like that with Scotty Miller's route, you're going to be able to hit that all day long. But what you'll see, hard lead, hard right lead. Now this is the only time that I would actually you know kind of entertain motioning out uh, Scotty Miller, and the primary reason is because um, they they can sometimes run into each other if they're in a press situation. So if it's man, if you know it's man to man, then I would just leave Scotty Miller on like a little hitch, and you'll see that's going to give the space, open space for Godwin to be able to get to the outside there. So, but this play overall, I think is one of the best plays from the Gun Bunch this year. Um, I think it's very hard to stop um, just with your zones. I think they're going to end up using that side, and if they use the left side, you're going to have the smart routed in route on the back side. So, um, this is one of the plays out of the Gun Bunch, which is broken down in full in our ebook on New England. Um, like I said, that ebook's going to come out in the next couple of days. So make sure that you've texted in. Let me know you want to receive that. Um, but other than that, guys, that's all we got. Make sure to uh, come by the live stream tonight. You might see me playing with this guide right here um, and see how it actually works in live online matches. Uh, we stream every single night at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time. So I'd love for you to come by and check out the stream, check out what we got going on. Um, and if you'd like to get a game with me, just set that up. All you got to do is text me, and we can set that up. We can get a uh, game scheduled. Uh, I play with subscribers every single night on uh, on the live feed. So uh, 10 o'clock Eastern for that. Again, we also upload tips every single day uh, at 2 o'clock, 4 o'clock, 6 o'clock, and 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern time. So if you want to get those tips, all you got to do is subscribe and turn on your notifications. And our text message members get a video every single Monday sent to them via text message. And it's typically a... Um, you know, big time breakdown. Maybe it's a big nickel over G run defense, which was 50 minute breakdown on how to stop every single run in Madden. Um, last week we did a gun bunch scheme, which was over an hour breakdown on how to run the gun bunch effectively in Madden 21. So those are all things that you can get with this text message membership. I think it's one of the best things going in the Madden community right now. Um, and so I wouldn't want you to miss out on that, but make sure to text in to get those free exclusive tips. Thanks for watching and we'll see you guys in our next video.